happened? Your father was talking about the new technique where we add um, when we do filled ribbon candy. When you get to the end where there's not much filling in it, we add a little bit more so that we can. Well, whose idea was it? That's the most important part. He's just being right. No, at the time he wasn't. He really was. He really. He's like, <laughs> I don't know how we thought of that. It's like you didn't think of that. I did. He probably dreamt of it. He tucked it asleep, <laughs> and I stole the idea out of the air, and I came in, and he never knew the difference. He probably dreamt of it and then told you about it. No, he didn't. And he you, talked in his sleep. And then, yeah, and then you told him about it. He's like, oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, that's exactly what happened. Like, yeah. all ideas here. That's exactly how it happened. You got me. Cracked good the thing code. I thought of it. Yep, Steve, you are a candy genius. Can I shut that door? Yeah, yeah thanks. <laughs> I forget. I never been. We haven't made room candy in a while. Mm -hmm. forget the, all the rules you have to follow. Mm -hmm. Color, do you think that bucket's gonna be by the end of the day? Um, I don't know if it will have a color. I don't know if any of our flavors have color. Mm. Orange, cherry, maybe a little pink, actually. So have you guys done the new technique a couple times now? We did it one day. Yeah, just one half day. But we did it a couple times, like for the batches. Yeah, did it worked every time. Yeah, it worked pretty good. Yeah. yeah. And then after you did it, we guys like, wow, why have we not done this every every time since we started? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> pretty you know, much. Sometimes you don't think of something right in yeah. front of you. I actually don't know if any of the viewers ever commented about it either. Because a lot of times they'll, they'll come at ideas. Sometimes they're good, sometimes not so much. But usually, <laughs> <laughs> but you think that um, one of them would have commented about it. I mean, maybe they did, but went under the radar. I don't know. Uh, maybe. That's a crazy noise. I was just thinking that too. <laughs> <laughs> like, I wonder if you were still with that here. I'm not sure what it is. Yeah, this is a little bit of a smaller back, so I just leave it alone. It'll be green regardless. Does this one get citric and Just citric. because it goes with the bar. It doesn't just stay still. Yeah, I'm gonna have to scrape it then. So you just have to wait for it to cool a little bit more? Yeah. I don't know if it will, so we'll just go for it. We'll just make a mess. Why not? Oh, that's not bad. That's gonna drip. Oh, Here it goes. Oh no. That's okay. <laughs> it's easier to cut when it doesn't do that, but it doesn't, it doesn't really matter. Yeah. Ooh, it's not even a little <laughs> bit hard. It's, it's like trying to cut your water. Yeah, not even. <laughs> a little bit. There we go. Oh, that's good. Somebody had a question recently. How often do we have to sharpen those scissors, or do we even do that? Oh, I've never sharpened them. No, we don't them. want them real sharp. Oh, okay. But the, the old ones that we're in the family for 
years, they were real dull. Mm. They weren't they weren't sharp at all. You don't need them to be sharp. Yeah. Mm. Uh, do you guys use the same scissors for like ribbon candy and hard candy and brittle? Yeah. Same. Mm -hmm. Yep. They do their job. Yeah, they don't need to be sharp. Are they better not being sharp? Oh uh, yeah, actually, you don't need. Somebody could cut themselves. Smart Never know. <laughs> Somebody named Julia can cut yeah. themselves. <laughs> Wait, did you say that you're accident prone? Um, yeah. But that's okay. Oh, the big long neck we used for the peanut brittle, that one is the sharpest one in the place. Oh, yeah. the big one? Oh, that's the one that looks underneath like. Underneath the table. Yeah, the one you scooch under. Yeah, that's It's really like sharpening itself every yeah, time, right? Yeah, that's super sharp. <laughs> <laughs> That's really got to be careful. It's like a knife. <laughs> it was a spatula, now it's a knife. What's like the biggest mistake you've had here so far? Like, yeah, like, like, biggest uh, mistake? Like as far as accident, like, because I know you, you burned your arm like that. Oh, yeah. Like that. Oh, like, like that? Yeah, yeah, I burnt my arm like really bad. I still have this scar. It you was like two it. months till the scab <laughs> wasn't even there. That one was pretty good. I also burnt myself right there too. How'd you get that one? Um, from that. Oh yeah. That gets really hot. It's yours <laughs> out of mine. What are oh. you doing over here? Uh, uh, Scott isn't here right now, but he'll never let us forget his knuckle. Oh, he Wait, talks about it. You were there all. for that, were you? No. <laughs> he tries to show me the scar all the time. <laughs> yep, big scar. Big scar. <laughs> <laughs> Big accident. <laughs> the big accident in 2022. <laughs> I believe him. Yeah, this definitely does seem kind of sticky. Uh oh. What's going on over here? here. I, I can't do it. I'm, uh, I'm right handed. I can't get <laughs> behind it. Yeah, we need to Do you guys need like, more cold water in the table? Yeah, he warmed it up with warm water. Because yeah, ribbon candy's a little smaller. It was like 65. Oh, because you didn't want it to cool down too fast. Yeah. Ribbon candy has to be kind of soft, so it doesn't harden over time. But, it might be a little too warm. That's okay. It'll get there eventually. Or maybe not. It might get cold. Maybe we're going to have to put the water in. We'll run cold water through the table now. So many knobs over here. Yeah, how'd you remember them all? <laughs> and basically, just snakes through the table, so you have it just like zigzagging all the way through the table, coming back down, and then it comes back out this other hose, and then it'll come right down here. here. So I just kind of like circulating through the whole time. Yep. Yeah, you can see it already went through at least once. Wow, look at that. Not even sticking anymore, huh? Magic. That was literally like a minute or two later. Yeah. <laughs> you don't mess around. <laughs> Problem solved. Yeah, yes. the candy seemed to harden a lot quicker too. It's ready. Got your concentration face on. You're ready for the day. Concentration face. It was not, it's not working. Put it's your angry on. face on. No, <laughs> he's got to put his concentration face on. He had it on, and then it I work, and then I mentioned it, and then he and then he took it off. <laughs> All right, so just put your concentration face back on, Dad. Well, I brought it over a little bit early. Like, I want to get it nice and white. Look. There you go. That's the concentration face. Okay. <laughs> Do you know what his concentration face looks like? Yes. He also has angry eyes <laughs> <laughs> and a confused face. Oh yeah. <laughs> He has that one a lot. He has three wow. normal faces. <laughs> 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 well, but his concentration face is just when he purses his lips. I mean, he's concentrating hard. And then I'll ask him, why are you confused, Steve? And then he'll tell me. So I know he was confused. <laughs> <laughs> He'd be like, where's the scissors? <laughs> I'd be like, over here. <laughs>
Now it's getting nice and white. Mm -hmm. Nice. Okay. I think I'll take it over now. How's that? Oh, wow. I don't even need it. Oh, this one doesn't get pulled. Eh. Eh. It looks cute like it is. Okay. I trust you guys. You guys are the candy makers. <laughs> I'm just a lowly camera. Yeah. <laughs> wow, that's I super annoying. Yeah. <laughs> does it usually make that sound? Um, yeah, Squeaky. actually, it does. <laughs> I think, oh, it's this thing, but I don't dare touch it because that's going to be hot. Well, especially over here. Yeah. When did you guys start doing just like the logs of caramel instead of pouring it? What's that? When did you guys start doing like the pieces of caramel instead of pouring it? Probably a while ago. Oh, yeah, it was, it was, yeah, it was quite a while ago now. Because it kept, kept getting a lot of blowouts, and yeah. finally we thought, why don't we try it when it's cold there? Mm -hmm. And it all melted in there, so it worked just fine. Okay. Ready? Yes. Wow. Look at that. That's why it looks like a turtle. That is a turtle. <laughs> <laughs> so, do you guys purposely make uh, the bottom a little bit smaller so then the top can drape over it? Yeah, then uh, it has nice whites. Like uh, edges of on um, the, the ribbon candy. You know, the edges will be nice and white. At least that's we try to anyway. You can kind of see that caramel in there. Yeah. Before it melts. Yeah. No, it's a little bit. Oh, so you wait a little bit? Yeah, okay. Just run that up. Add it. How long have you been doing the, the ribbons now? Mm -hmm. I think it's pretty much since I started. Oh, okay. A couple of days after I started, so maybe like a month. Oh, they threw right to the wolves, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Where's that caramel? <laughs> Struck caramel. You struck it. Struck caramel. Struck it big. You guys are rich in caramel. It's in there. I think it's easy to see. Oh, it's even easy to see on the green side actually. Maybe because it wasn't cold. Here we can show you. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> a lot of, there's a lot of caramel. It's a lot. <laughs> Do you think? Yeah, it seems like people get um, bigger veins of caramel when you guys don't melt it. I think yeah. it's a little bit more solid. Yeah. Ooh, wow, this is uh, improvements all around. Yeah, because when we put it in too warm, it would, it would melt the uh, candy itself mm. and, and then it would pop out. Mm -hmm. It would blow out. So. Is it getting hard? No, the caramel itself is just starting to melt a little bit uh, so, it, so it's kind of hard to pull out when it's kind of still fighting it it's cold it's still like nice solid. yeah 
once it warms up in there a little bit, then it'll be easier. But there's lots of caramel anyway. <laughs> True that. It's thick. Now you can see it. Yep. Now it's flowing better. It's warm though. It seems a lot softer. You don't have to fight it as much, huh? Yeah. I had to really pull it. <laughs> When do you guys have to use the new technique? Well, once it gets back here, you yeah. can the see the caramel right to here. You can see it. So once it starts running really well. That's my phone. You're supposed to be on silent. <laughs> We're filming. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was your uh, camera. <laughs> My camera? <laughs> it sings Thomas the Tank Engine? Yeah. Thomas the Tank? Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. That was one of the shows you guys loved watching when you kids, right? Yeah. You guys loved it. You did. <laughs> you even had a time with the train. Yeah, like old toy train. Yeah. Cute. I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. <laughs> think I can. Good show. Your huh? affirmations of the day? Oh no, that was what tank. Uh, time with the tank engine. I know. Did you say that? Probably. I don't know. I probably did. Five year old. That's a that's a good show for a five year old. He's a new kid, like affirmations, like, oh, if you just tell yeah, yourself, I think I can, I think, I think, that was think the I point. can. Is it not? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah that, that's the point of like little kid shows, like, to they teach good you stories stuff. and stuff. Yeah. It's always a lesson. Like, yeah. Full House, ever seen Full House? Oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> it's so cringy. But then, but it, you learn. When you, know? you uh, when you grow up, then you can enjoy shows that don't have any any sort of lessons. It's like, just, like, it's always nonsense. sunny in Philadelphia, yeah. South Park, like Seinfeld. Euphoria. Like, there's no substance. <laughs> But it's Just so good. <laughs> yeah, a little bit longer. You can stretch it. Just, uh, stretch it how you go. Okay. So this is the new method. That you dreamt up, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Just trying to do a taco. We just make a burrito. <laughs> Caramel burrito. It's pretty much everything. Turn back into hard to pull out again. Yeah, a little bit because I, I put it in a little. See how thick that is? Yeah. I usually don't put it in quite that thick, so I just try, I'm just trying it out. But you just want to give the people the money's worth. Yeah, I want to make try, try to put more caramel in there, but got you samples. Know, you can only go <laughs> so far. Almost too hard. This is a thick piece. Wow. Well, Maybe if people write the word sample. What the heck? <laughs> My fingers aren't even that long. Oh, and it's breaking. Okay. Look how fun. What are we going to do with these pieces? Samples. Well, they can go, like, to um, make weight. Yeah. Oh, okay. Whatever happens first. So how come it's, like, so thick right now? Oh. What's he going to do? Trying this side. Whoa. I've never seen this done before. The caramel's in there. Oh, yeah, it's definitely in there. Oh, out. coming out a little. Oh. Maybe not that side. <laughs> We're <going> back. <laughs> oh, no. What are you going to do now? Just warm it up a little more. You can do it. Dad, just remember I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. I can. I can. I can do it. Never give up. Remember that, never give up. It can be worse than the first time we did it and we put like a honk this big in the back and it was just <laughs> a brick, like this big. <laughs> and we, he pulled it out, so he did good. <laughs> so he can definitely do so this. Somebody time. got a lot of caramel, huh? Like it was, it was this inside of a piece of crazy. <laughs>
like mostly caramel. Okay. Uh, it was all caramel. <laughs> a little bit of candy. Oh, there you go. That's more looking like ribbon. Yeah. Big ribbons. Those are the bad. Nothing wrong with being fat. <laughs> Yeah, but like, not much. there's not though. <laughs> there's not? <laughs> no. Okay, let a couple pieces go through. Yeah. Sometimes it looks like there's some, but there's actually It's like it's right there. It's right coming up. Okay. Yeah, because I can see it. Yeah. There's a big vein Yeah, it's coming up. Yeah, they're going to strike caramel pretty soon. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thicker, maybe it'd be more all overall, but it made it harder. Mm -hmm. Oh wow! It, if you make it thinner, but like longer, I think it'd be yeah, just better. a little, little uh, thinner would be better because it holds the takes so long to melt down a little bit. Mm -hmm. That's why it's hard to pull out. Yeah, it's, it's basically like trying to just pull out caramel. Yeah. Because the heat of the heater is on it, so it usually gets it, but when it's a little too thick, it doesn't work mm -hmm. as well. Mm -hmm. Or what if you put the, that caramel in front of the heater for like a minute before you guys put it in? Yeah, that's what I'm going to do, actually. Just heat up the last piece. There's a big piece in there. <laughs> Someone got a lot of caramel. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, my God, that's, look how thick. That's all caramel in there. It's going to be impossible to move. <laughs> Someone's gonna eat that. That's pretty good. Goodbye. Uh, good work, guys. So where is the this is the the section right here is without any caramel yeah. or without enough? Might have a little, might not. This is filled. But you, yeah, it definitely looks like there's more filled with caramel than you guys usually have. I think this, like this section's usually a little bit bigger. Definitely. For green apple, we usually have like sometimes it's like half and half. <laughs> But, yeah. Not today. Not today. Ready? I'm gonna put the caramel on. 
This time we made the caramel a little bit thinner. Just like smushed it down. Okay, yeah, because the last time it was kind of hard to uh, pull it out. It was so it was cold on here, and it was thicker. And so when I pulled it out, it wasn't quite melted enough. Car yeah. When caramel's cold, it doesn't stretch very well. No. So <laughs> we just warmed it up a little bit with the heater. So that's good. Right to the end. Right to Okay, we're ready. Now it's really a turtle. <laughs> and then that piece is for the very end. Mm -hmm. So this should work out better because last time it, was, it makes it difficult to pull out when it's a little too thick. I was trying to make it thicker so that there'd be more caramel in there, but this made it too hard. Yeah, because <laughs> you guys are still kind of figuring this out, right? Yeah, trying to, yeah, I think we got it pretty close, but... Just working out the kinks. Yeah, just trying to make it better all the time. You still have to like wait a minute or two before you pull it out? Yeah, I'm trying to just push down on the candy a little bit to uh, get it Like get the heat of the there. candy there. Yeah, the heat on it, yeah. To melt the caramel. Yep. That's a neat edge. Because the opposite is usually yeah, mostly white with some yeah. green middle. Looks cool. Giant tongue. In oh here. no, I already missed that. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Dang, nabbit. We were watching the Velocipaster trailer and. Yeah. Got, Same uh, as last time. Put this smaller. The moral of the story is it's working out. It's working. It's working good and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, it's right in here. Yeah, you can see the shape. Then there's caramel here too, so it's going to be a lot of wow. caramel. Should be fine. So this batch now it'll work. I know last batch we were saying like, wow, look at this new technique we're doing. And then it didn't work as well as yeah, it didn't work as, long as well because the caramel was too thick. Yeah. Nothing. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, it's still oh, yeah. white on both sides. You can still see it. Though. Yeah, you can see it. You can see it in there. I can cut off a piece. Not my fingers. Watch this. <laughs> oh wow. Look at all. That's a bunch. Hmm. For the end, that's crazy. Yeah. In a video, it's kind of hard to tell the difference between melted peanut butter and melted caramel. Yeah, yeah. It looks the same. They taste the same. They taste the same. <laughs> what kind of caramel are you eating, or what kind of peanut butter are you eating? I'm just kidding. You eat uh, caramel and jelly sandwiches. That'd be fire. <laughs> Would it? Yeah. Uh, I don't know about that. It'd be really sweet. But. Yeah, I think your teeth would probably hurt. I eat candy all day anyway, so. Yeah? <laughs> Did you before working here? No. No. Oh. Just while working here. Yes. That's what everyone in the comments says. That they would just about caramel and jelly sandwiches? Um, that and that they would just eat a bunch of candy if they worked here. Oh, they do say that. Yeah. It's true. You would. There is. I'm leaving in the last one. I think there's a lot of caramel in on this one. This honestly. one, this one actually might be the fullest of them all. Yeah, that's just. So I can't even move it. Thick, full of caramel. She fat. <laughs> and we love her. <laughs> Look, this is 
his own little yeah. thing. Yeah, that, that's like, awesome. That's like barely like any. Pieces, barely Cause it, it used to be like half the batch would be. Like two full boxes. Yeah. <laughs> now it's barely any. Yeah, that's awesome. It's like maybe a, not even a quarter of the batch, like maybe a fifth or sixth of the batch. Yeah, I get to eat the last baby. Samples? You want to do a taste test? Oh, sure. <laughs> oh, that'll twist my arm. Oh, I feel warm. <laughs> Everyone in the comments is so jealous right now. It's the best flavor. What if it was cranberry caramel filled? It'd probably be the best. That would be even better? If you were to make your own ribbon candy, like Julia's favorites, what would it be, you think? It would be cranberry. Anything filled? Mm-hmm. Caramel. 